So we all know about these puny little parkour courses. They're way too easy, super easy to do, that basically any even noob can do. Like, there's so many shortcuts that you can possibly take. It's like, it's just like, basically, the parkour that, like, noobs and, like, the worst players ever could even do. Like, it's just super duper easy, like, so many parkour cuts that you can do. It's just, I don't know, it's just not the, the easiest parkour thing ever. But, this is the custom made by me, made by me. One that's a little bit trickier, basically, my own. As you can see, it looks pretty gigantic, but it's it's pretty easy. It's easier than you think. So, basically, I'm going to show you what you have to do. So, the first part, you know, you bounce up here. Then, you got, like, not, not bad parkour, but trickier than the other one. So, you know, pretty easy parkour. This is just an auto little thing that just brings you right up here. And then this, just a bounce pad, leads you up here. Not too shabby. And then, you get to this chiller part. You gotta do that. And then you're supposed to not glide or redeploy. <laughs> Let me show you what you're supposed to do. I didn't get hit by those chillers, luckily. Um, basically... You're supposed to do that, and then that, and then, uh, yeah, you've just completed the course. Congratulations to you, I mean, I mean me, for completing the course. Very simple course, though. Like, as you can see, it was a lot shorter than you'd think it is. Like, it's a lot, it's a lot shorter than you think it is, basically. Um, yeah, that's, uh... Not supposed to, uh, yeah, it's supposed to be like that. But, uh, yeah, so, you know, pretty simple. Simple stuff, but still trickier, way trickier than this. So, that was mine. And this is Epic's. I'm gonna not cheat or anything, not take shortcuts. Basically, very, very easy parkour here. And guess what? If you fall... <coughs> Sorry. <coughs> but <coughs> Sorry about that. <coughs> Sorry about that, but um Dude, that, that, honestly, that sounded like a lot of bad coughing right there. <laughs> it, it was less worse than you think it was, but. Basically, super easy, like, just easy, easy parkour. Then, you know, you get up to here. Pretty easy to avoid that. Then, you know, really, really easy jumps. Then... This part looks really bad, but really, it is so easy. Like, so, so easy. Easier than you think it is. Now, look at this. Look, look at this. Like, look. You gotta jump down here. Like, what kind of staircase is this? Gotta go all the way down here. What, like, what kind of staircase is that? What kind of monstrosity is that? Ew. But this... Guys, this is the new one, and let me show ya. If you fall, you can get back. You missed the first jump, you can just go down and get back up here. You miss, you just, like, you somehow mess this up because you accidentally jump? Well, guess what? You can just go right down here. Pretty easy. If you go up here, you mess this up, 
you go right back down here. Oh, wait, that's not supposed to happen. <laughs> let me, uh, whoa. Let me go back, show you that there's a difference. But, um, told you, like, see? It, like, it'll, it'll catch you. And then there's a slip and slide right here. Oh, jeez. But, uh, yeah, there's, um, a slip and slide right here. Wee! I mean, you can do that, but what's that gonna do? Nothing. So, basically. And then, over here. We gotcha. We gotcha. It's alright. You can be saved. It doesn't really matter. So, let's just, you know, get through the course. So, you know, you can get out of every single situation that you go through. Pretty, pretty simple. Uh, yeah. It also allows you to move while you're dancing when your children on. But, uh, yeah, I just wanted to show you this. You're probably wondering what the heck this is. This is just a little battle arena that I made. And, uh, <laughs> basically, just a little battle arena. You get some chests. Then what you can do. Okay, let me first show you this. Basically, you can get to here. You go through this little maze thing. Pretty simple. There's a window right here that teases you. Then you gotta basically jump over that. Then you can just sneak right under that. Then. Inside here, basically a scar, some other legendary things that you can get. Uh, yeah. Then, as you can see, you can get out, obviously, by not doing that, but by jumping on the chest, and then on there. And honestly, this rock parkour, it looks pretty easy, but it's actually, like this jump right here, actually kind of hard and then this is a trick jump if you jump you're gonna fail but then if you don't jump you can literally just walk right out and now time to show you what this is so you jump up here Right, you just, you know, you jump up here, you get to some rocks. The rocks are some pretty easy parkour, too. And don't worry, there's a, the exact same thing on the other side. And then you can jump up here. Look at this, you're up here. You're, and this actually right here, as you can see, is the maze. So yeah, pretty interesting, huh? So now you jump to there, then you jump to here. Open up the door. We just straight up to here, and up here is a rocket launcher. So yeah, that's just this little thing that I created. Also, you can there's literally the exit right here. I mean, you're not supposed to go out that way, but like it's a thing. And you know what? Just to make it look a little bit better, just that. I just realized that there's no way out if you um if you fall. Yeah, you can go down here, kids, but don't. Because then you just reset yourself. I mean, you can go back up, but like... I'm beginning to feel like a rap god, rap god. I don't know, I just like that song. Uh, yeah. There's gotta be a way to escape if you fall, I guess. Um... <laughs> it's like, I didn't think about this. We might just leave it like that, honestly. Yeah. This is our way out. Because then, basically, you can get back up here, and now you can try again. So, yeah, that's that's how we're going to get out. And, of course, there's a little battlefield out here. So, yeah, there's one thing over there. Basically, gray items, and the other one is, like, a sniper rifle, stuff like that. Same thing on this side. 
Except, it seems like this is a little bit easier to get. It's less out in the open. I think this is actually, no, that's definitely the gray side. And then this is, so uh, yeah. Basically. Yeah, I just, let me see where the direct center is. I think it's right here. <laughs> it's like, tell me if you can sing the fast part and rap God. It's hard, but it's obviously possible. Yeah, this side. One right there. Um, yeah, I guess this is uneven. Not directly in the center. One, one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four. I know, it's not directly centered, but it's fine. You can live with it. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> uh, yeah, this is, this is all it is. Thank you for watching. This video was longer than I thought it would be. And, uh, yeah, goodbye. Wait, before I, before I say goodbye, if you can wrap the fast part in Eminem, I'll try real fast. Uh, some alumma dumma loom is used to when I'm a human. What I gotta do to get a third of you? I'm superhuman, innovative, and I'm out of room so that anything you say and Rick is saying, I'm from me and it'll go to you. Never study more than ever, demonstrating how to give all the audience a feeling like it's levitating, never fading, and I'm letting his off for everyone any further than they can say. I felt like they were celebrating, cause I'm the way to get them motivated. I'm like elevating music, you make elevator music. Oh, he's too mainstream. Well, that's what they do with the controls to confuse it. It's not hip hop and swap, cause I found a heck of a way to fuse it. Yeah, I'm bad at it, but like. <coughs> Goodbye, everyone. <laughs> I just embarrassed myself for the last part. Just goodbye. Bye. Bye.